It's a very exciting week for bar owners and bar goers here in the Mountain State. Beginning tomorrow, bars will be able to reopen at 50% capacity. Now, of course, there are some rules. West Virginia Tonight reporter Cassidy Wood joins us live on Capitol Street where several of those bars will reopen. Cassidy, how does it look out there? Mark, as you can imagine, just a bunch of smiles and excitement out here. I spoke to a couple bar owners and they're just so happy to get back to some sense of normalcy. Now, as you mentioned, there is a new uh, round of guidelines that the governor has rolled out for this specific reopening, and those are centered around, of course, social distancing and reducing contact. It's crazy. Paul Greco owns both Sam's Uptown Cafe and the Red Carpet. He was able to open both for half capacity dining on Thursday. Do whatever you can do to, to stay open and keep people working. Now this outdoor dining area has been open and the bar has been closed, but tomorrow that will change. It's been a lot of work coming in here every morning and cleaning. Tomorrow bars reopen to 50% capacity. This comes with new guidelines from the governor's office, which are centered around maintaining maintaining social distancing and reducing contact. Some of the guidelines include maintaining six feet of distance between bar chairs and dining tables, no more than six people per group, and limiting contact with guests. Now with bars reopening for the first time in over two months, a big question is if a ton of people come out, how will these guidelines be enforced? Well, I think they're letting each establishment kind of govern that as long as you're not busy. Greco says when dining reopened to 50%, they really didn't have a problem. There's only been one day here at the carpet where um, we've had an issue and, and we just had people waiting, you know, we just wouldn't let them in. He says his biggest concern with the new guidelines, the curfew. I think they've been doing a really good job and a fair job of, of enforcing um, all the rules and compliances. The most important thing would be maybe extending the hours as long as you're running half capacity and you're following all the safety guidelines. I don't see why we couldn't. Right now, bars can only stay open until 10 p.m., something that hurts places like the carpet, which thrive on late night business. So still some uncertainties, but so much excitement as the Mountain State continues to reopen. Now, the majority of these bars will be opening up tomorrow at 11 a.m. I know I'm excited. I can't wait. This is for now live in Charleston for West Virginia Tonight. I'm Cassidy Wood. A lot of them serve good food, too. All right, Cassidy, thanks.